Okay, okay step. Ready? ready? Sunday, September 7, 2014. This uh, male induction, 11 months old, right? Yeah. Comes in for uh, what purpose? Diarrhea. Diarrhea for many days? Uh, since Wednesday, so. Five. Five days. Five days, huh? Yeah. Watery one, right? Yeah, watery. And uh, what, what uh, color? And yellowish? Brown. Brownish? Smell? Yellowish. Smelly or not? No. No smell. Normal. Normal stool smell. But no blood smell. Huh? No. And then we check the mouth. The temperature is okay. But uh, we can't wait the dog. No electricity until 1 p.m. Now you can see this dog has very good teeth. Be a tartar, they, they haven't. Uh, they didn't brush your teeth. Now the interesting thing is here, okay, which I show you. Now you can see a very big house uh, on the hard palate. Okay, relax. Okay. Hashi. Where you hold the box, suppose? Okay, okay, relax. Okay. When you come. It's painful, I think. Did you manage to get it? Wait. Okay, relax, okay, relax. You're talking to him, huh? Hashi, you okay? Good boy. Okay. Mm. See the mouth on it? Oh. Now you can see the house. Uh, uh, he's a nice and dumb, he's got some dark. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, yeah. okay. I don't know where I can catch it at first. I can catch it. In the bill. Okay, okay. Now we we'll check whether there's anything stuck inside the hot pellet. Okay, little bit. Little bit. Good boy. Good boy. So the. Yeah, I see the tongue. Check the tongue, nothing. Check the tongue, nothing. I'll check the tonsil. Consuls are okay, not inflamed. Okay. And uh, you can manage okay, okay, okay. okay, then you see the gum now. You see the gum here. Now, sometimes this gum might be eating something like uh, slippers, shoes. Does yeah, he do that? He, he does. Uh, but of course, he does. Now, you see the gum. Uh. Hmm. Now, you notice the gum. Hello, hello, come here. Mm -hmm. no, he doesn't like it. Now, you see the gums is inflamed. Uh. Oh. Now, this is not normal. Uh. Oh. This is uh, much inflamed. Normally, it should be this color. Uh. Mm -hmm. It should be not inflamed. Mm -hmm. This is uh, a periodontal disease, uh, uh, stage one. Uh. For some reason, his gums are inflamed. Eh, you mm. see? Then you come this side and see. This really way. unusual. Can you mm. take a picture? Click. One click. Uh. I don't know whether it's born, born like this or not. Do you brush your teeth or anything? Mm, have lah. Huh? Not every time but sometimes. Is it due to brushing? Maybe, yeah, maybe it might. Sometimes it might. might yeah. Really? The okay, so this one is a very unusual thing. Normally the, the, the gum should be just pink. Mm. Mm. Don't have such a big inflammation. Uh. Mm. This is gingivitis, it's stage 1. Stage 1 means uh, not, not very serious, just a gingiva and yeah, inflamed. Uh. Uh, so these are two findings. Now I'm going to check his uh, stomach, abdomen. Uh. Okay. Uh, normally we do palpation. Palpation, palpation of the abdomen to check whether there is any pain in the first of all. Now we can see that uh, it's quite... It's not quite happy with it. But, uh, there's a lot of gas, I can feel yeah. the gas. Yes, 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 definitely. I always say it's stomach rumbling. Yeah, so, so the, maybe the owner doesn't know if the dog might have been uh, eating some uh, something off the ground. Now this is a male dog. Okay, now we turn upside down. Come ready. Okay. Now to see outside first, there's no electricity. We have to turn upside down. Just have a thorough uh, examination. Check the anus, of course. Huh? Okay. Check the anus. Anus is sore or not? Not sore. No rectal prolapse. Always check because if you don't check, you won't know. See, eh? so normal. And uh, other than that, the dog looks looks good. Mm -hmm. So the diagnosis is uh, gastroenteritis, acute with gas formation. Mm -hmm. But uh, what's the cause is uh, up to the owner. But what I suspect this dog has been uh, going around the house eating plants and and socks and shoes and licking something so causing a stomach upset mm. intestinal upset there's a bit of abdominal pain come here come here now oh, he's he doesn't let me to touch him he's scared of you painful yeah painful maybe he's unwell this one mm. okay just check any pain the liver mm. and stomach now you can see the yeah, hunch hunchback hunch, hunchback is uh, some pain of the abdomen, otherwise it won't punch me, the back is straight. Yeah. Mm -hmm.
possible it's quite frightening. So check the pulse. Check the pulse also for the pressure, the pulse rate and pressure. Is eating or not now? No. Very little. Drinking? Drink okay, drink a lot. Water. <coughs> Eat little. Yeah. Urine? A lot. <coughs> yeah. yeah. Urine normal. Pulse is alright. Huh? Then you, urine is normally <coughs> like yesterday. The day before he never urine at all. Then never really do much water. But yesterday uh, was okay. He didn't drink any urine. Then la, uh, uh, urine only the then complain the stool. Yeah, only the stools, so, stools only. Yeah. So now we have to give him a drip, and then we will put the anti diarrhea and mm. antibiotics direct through the drip into the bloodstream. Must do drip, I cannot injection. And they're not so effective. Eh? Uh. Not because it's a five days. Uh. Uh. Mm. Okay, okay, we can.